Hello ladies! Right, now then, welcome to 21st Century UK Trans. No, 21st Century Trans UK. I have not posted in a while and I'm sorry about that. Um, I'm going to talk to you today about a very specific problem that I don't think gets a lot of airtime. And that's residual problems we may have from our time in the patriarchy. Now, I have one specific one that I'm not proud of, but I'm going to talk to you about it anyway. Now, when I thought I was a man and lived as a man and all the rest of it, I thought along very similar lines to a lot of men. Now, I never considered myself sexist, misogynistic or, or anything like that. But I realise now, at 41 years old, um, that I did have some unconscious negative attitudes. One of them in particular affects me to this day. Now, when I was in my 20s, late teens, 20s through mid-20s, whatever, um, I thought women should shave their legs, their bits and their pits. Obviously, that is wrong. If a woman decides to shave, it is for herself, not because society expects it and not because of a man. I know that it was wrong of me to think that way. And as I grew older, I realised this. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm isolating with COVID at the moment. So my voice is a little bit creaky. However, it is actually something that still affects me to this day because if I let my leg hair grow too long or if I don't shave my pits or my bits I do not feel as feminine I do not feel like I I am as much as a woman that I would do if I had shaved these things and that is a hang up from my old patriarchal days I'm working on it. I let them grow. I rarely shave my legs these days anyway. I don't know, once every two, three weeks or something. I can't be arsed. I'm a single woman. I've got no one to shave them for and I wouldn't shave them for anybody else anyway. Can't be arsed with a regrowth itch. But yeah, it still affects me negatively psychologically. And I'm just wondering if anybody else has anything similar, any similar <clears throat> hang-ups from your time as a man. Um, if you have, so out of curiosity, you can message me in complete confidence uh, on 21st century trans UK at gmail.com. So that's 21st century trans UK at gmail.com. I'll put it in the description as well. Um, I'm just curious if anybody else has anything similar. Uh, yeah, and that's all I really wanted to say on this one. Um, so, but please remember, if you are transitioning, or if you're even thinking of transitioning, you are so brave. And I love you for it. So be safe, be well. And be happy.